Hey there, welcome back to the Noctis on YouTube. Imagine this, your only tools are a harness and rope. As a technician, these are your lifelines, keeping you secure hundreds of meters off the ground. Take, for example, wind turbines. The average height of these behemoths is around 80 meters. One of the tallest is the giant Haliad X wind turbine, boasting a tower height of 260 meters, a rotor length of 220 meters, and individual blades stretching 107 meters each. To put it into perspective, the Haliad X is almost as tall as the Eiffel Tower in Paris, France. In terms of diameter, it's even larger than the London Eye. Now picture having to climb up one of these turbines for repairs, equipped with nothing but your trusty harness and rope. It's a daunting task, to say the least. But why are wind turbines so crucial? Wind turbines are one of the most popular sources of renewable energy worldwide. By harnessing wind power to drive electrical generators, wind turbines produce electricity without emitting greenhouse gases. A single Halida X unit, for instance, can generate a whopping 12 megawatts of electricity, enough to power around 16,000 homes in Europe. Typically installed in remote areas and towering hundreds of meters high, wind turbines are lightning magnets. Despite being equipped with lightning protection systems, a strike can still damage the exterior, especially the fiberglass blades. Additionally, wind turbines are vulnerable to damage from harsh weather, exposure to seawater, and other extreme conditions. To keep these electricity-generating titans running smoothly throughout their life cycle, regular maintenance is essential. This, however, is no easy feat. It requires skilled and experienced technicians, also known as wind techs, to install, inspect, repair, replace, operate, overhaul, and maintain wind turbines. And this job is not for the faint-hearted. It's considered one of the most dangerous due to its high-risk nature. The number of accidents in the wind turbine sector has risen with the increasing number of turbines being built. This is because technicians must conduct repairs and maintenance at very high locations, especially on the blades and nose located atop the turbine tower. In addition to carrying out repairs, Wind turbine technicians also have to gather and report all data obtained from the turbines, inventory spare turbine parts, and in some cases, participate in the construction of turbines. The daily duties of a wind turbine technician can vary depending on the employer, but here are some of their common tasks in detail. They're responsible for turbine installation. These wind techs survey the installation site, clear the location, dig trenches, and erect the turbine towers. Once installed, they ready the turbines to supply electricity to the grid. After installation is complete, they conduct tests to determine if any adjustments need to be made. When a turbine is up and running, Wintex detect early signs of damage by continuously monitoring the turbines electronically from a control center. They also perform routine physical inspections on the internal and external parts of the wind turbines, report their findings, and schedule repairs. Some of the turbine parts susceptible to damage include the converter system, blade pitch system, and the variable speed control system. In the event of a malfunction or damage to a wind turbine, Wintex repair the damaged parts and mechanical components of the turbine, the wind farm substation, the transmission system, as well as the fiber optic sensor and control systems. There are instances where they have to remove and replace damaged parts, such as instruments measuring wind direction and speed before they can repair them. The frequency of maintenance depends on the employer's policy. Some employers may require annual comprehensive maintenance on turbines, while others may require wind turbine technicians to do so up to three times a year. In addition, wind turbine technicians have to document their daily observations and activities with the turbines. They also have to create clear reports about inspections, maintenance, repairs, and testing tasks. Sometimes companies may assign wind turbine technicians to manage several wind turbines at once and require them to order machine spare parts for repairs. Employers can also ask them to keep records of the machine spare parts under their responsibility. 
These records help track expenses and create an accurate resource plan. A critical role of a wind turbine technician is to gather relevant and useful data for analysis and research purposes. For instance, wind speed data collected through an anemometer helps determine the power output of the turbine. They must have extensive knowledge and skills about the mechanical, electrical, hydraulic, and computer systems present in wind turbines. They also must be able to work at heights, under pressure, and in fluctuating and often extreme weather conditions. The hardest part to reach on a wind turbine is the blades. To fix them, technicians use a rope access method, which involves using safety ropes to climb to hard-to-reach locations. They also use portable generators to install safety ropes on wind turbine structures. Besides using safety rope methods, wind turbine technicians also use inspection platforms, like those developed by the Polish company Farween. With this platform, technicians can collect geometric data on wind turbine blades, and analyze any damage or wear and tear. There's also the use of aerial platform trucks equipped with a hydraulic boom and a bucket that can move vertically or horizontally. These vehicles are equipped with safety systems, such as safety ropes and braking systems, to ensure the safety of technicians working at heights. Even though wind turbine maintenance is carried out regularly, there's no 100% guarantee that wind turbines won't break down. If the damage is severe and can't be repaired, replacing it with a new wind turbine is deemed more efficient than fixing the broken one. Take an example of a wind turbine fire in Germany in 2014, where the blaze took place 100 meters off the ground, making it impossible for the firefighters to reach. Eventually, they had to demolish the wind turbine with a carefully executed explosion. So, to minimize such catastrophic failures when working, they need to ensure that all wind turbine components are functioning correctly and meet quality and safety standards. When a wind turbine malfunctions, they need to diagnose the problem and make necessary repairs ASAP. They also need to report any incidents or occurrences on the wind turbine to their manager or supervisor. Being a wind turbine technician is risky business. They have to climb super high ladders, use chain hoists, which often involve lifting heavy loads on a giant pole with electrical currents ranging from 600 to 35,000 volts. So, falling from a height, getting electrocuted by high voltage, fog, and hydraulic fluid leaks are real risks they have to deal with. They must adhere to strict occupational safety and health standards and use adequate safety equipment. Also, the job of a wind turbine technician is greatly affected by ever-changing weather conditions. There are times when they have to work in scorching heat during the summer or in freezing cold during the winter. In these conditions, they're likely to suffer from dehydration or hypothermia. They also have to brace themselves for strong winds, rain, snow, or storms. Therefore, being a wind turbine technician requires courage, physical resilience, and high technical skills. Despite the risks, the demand for jobs in this field continues to grow each year, not just because of the increasing number of wind turbines, but also due to the hefty paychecks involved. On average, a wind turbine technician in the United States makes around $66,933 per year. The highest paying city for wind turbine technicians is San Francisco, where they earn about $99,763 annually, with total average compensation being 49% higher than the U.S. average per year. That wraps up today's video. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more awesome videos. Catch you in the next one.